Day one of the 2012 Big South Baseball Championships in High Point, North Carolina. Liberty Flames, the three seed, taking on the six seed UNC Asheville Bulldogs. Big South leader in wins, John Nickley getting the nod on the bump. Second inning, he gets a little help from his mates. Ian Graham smashes one in the hole at short. But look at the pick by my man, Zach Haley. Turn the double play, 6-4-3, and the flame train runs on Diesel. Diesel's Haley's nickname, in case y'all didn't know. Third inning, Flames up 2-0. Alex Close going Jenga. Center field and gone. Two-run shot and a history maker for Close. 13th of the year breaks the single-season Liberty freshman record, ties the Big South freshman single-season record. Big South freshman of the year puts the Flames up 4-0 after three. Flames getting it done with the long ball and the small ball. Fourth inning, Ian Parmley lays down the bunt. Dean Rowland off the mound, smothers, nobody's covering first. Dalton Sipe scores from third, flames up 5-0 after four. All the while, John Nickley's just cruising along. Two out runner at second in the fifth, Hunter Bryant swinging. John's third strikeout of the day. Top of seven, first real sign of trouble. Bulldogs with a run in and two more on. 2-2 pitch and Nickley gets Jordan Lurie swinging. Wimmer throws him out at first, that'll wrap up the inning. Seven strong for Nickley with four strikeouts. Hey, speaking of Trey Wimmer, here he is capping off a two-hit, four RBI day. Laces one into right center for a double. That'll score two. Flames blow it open with a four-run seventh. They go on to win it 9-2 over UNC Asheville. Liberty now 39-18 and on the year. Flames will face the winner of Campbell and High Point. That game suspended due to rain Tuesday. First four RBI game of the season for Wimmer. Oh, it's awesome. You know, I've come in struggling the whole year. Um, feels good to come in with a kind of a clean slate for the tournament. You know, we always talk about starting over whenever the tournament time comes. And so it's good to kind of start off on a fresh foot and have a good note or a good uh, little game to start off on.